a very good afternoon to you guys ash vlogs in the house i'm just on my way to london to channel s studio to do a quiz show today i'm not very confident because it's the very first time i'm doing a quiz show but uh, i've kind of bottled up if you have a dream if you have an ambition and uh, you need to pursue it basically even uh, whatever it takes and it's all a learning curve so let's go to london and see how it goes guys it was a bit of a mission getting ready because i'm not a an early person, I like to wake up a bit late, and you know what, guys? Just tell you a bit of secret. Recently, I put a lot of weight on, so not weight as a lot of fat, but actually size on as well. So I was struggling to uh, fit into all these shirts, and anyway, I managed to fit into this shirt. It's a bit t still tight, yo, but I've kind of just managed to fit in. And um, what I'm gonna say, just one more thing. Um, I kind of had a break from YouTube for a while. I think around three or four months. And uh, recently I've been getting a lot of attention. I said, hey, you're the guy that does the vlogs, right? And you've been doing a bit of a TikTok videos as well, right? Keep up the good work, keep on doing it. So I thought, hey, so that's a compliment. So why don't I keep on doing it? So I thought I'll just do one more vlog of my London trip to Channel S Studio to do a quiz show. And um, guys, I'll see you soon at the other side. So let's go to London because I've got a long journey, yo. most frustrating thing with any drivers is traffic whenever you're traveling somewhere and you're stuck in traffic for a very long time it gets very frustrating very annoying and you can't seem to understand why can't they ever work over the night or in the morning they always have to do road work 24 7 and it's a never ending story in England road works is always a chaos so much inconvenience for all the people every single day hours and hours and hours and it's a never ending story I don't know when they'll ever finish it and look at it, it's proper gridlock normally from Sheffield to London it takes about three hours I think today it'll take around Five hours and it's absolutely ridiculous. Now whatever you have babe, you can make the whole room stay. But you know that my favorite is when you're rocking that this is way. Oh they no sort of suit the carida. Oh they no sort of suit the carida. The suit the carida. They no sort of suit the carida. We need to lack the panja, but it lack the patola, lack any to sorry to what can eat they no so the suit the carida. So guys, I'm officially here just around the corner of Channel S Studio. It's been a long drive guys, it's taken me over four hours. Now let's go and get over this done with. And guys, I'm dying for a leak as well. So this is London, the capital city. After a long drive, four hours drive, they say um, there's all different kind of tiring work. So when you're doing a normal physical work, it tires you out physically. And when you're actually driving for so many hours, it tries you out mentally. So driving is very hard and mentally and focusing on the road for so many hours. Oh, parking is a bit of a nightmare in London. They don't have any parking spaces. Why can't they build sufficient spaces? Because there's so much people here and where are the people gonna park? And we're just having a little walk because I had to park the car miles away. And Channel S Studio is just front of me there. I'm looking good, ready, and uh, I hope it's quite easy. I'm feeling a bit nervous, and I've never done this before. So let's do it. This is a brief insight of how it looks. I don't think I'll be able to um, film much while it's going on, but I'll try to do as much as I can. Just waiting for the director to turn up. 
as it's the first time I'm doing a quiz show, I'm grateful that they've actually gave me this opportunity, this platform, to um, try something different. As you know, I've done a TV commercial this year that's going to be released soon. This is going to be the second quiz. I've got a stand-up uh, comedy act soon in uh, Manchester, Oldham. I've got a few other things going on this year. It's going to be quite a productive year this year, a quite interesting year this year. And just um, watch all the stuff. I'm going to try to do as much as I can just to entertain you guys. I've not done any comedy sketches for a while, but I will be doing a comedy sketch in the future, inshallah. Ash vlogs in the house, and this is the studio. And as you can see, guess what? I've just gave you a little insight of what's going to go on. I'm basically going to be doing a quiz show with another participant. And this is how the studio looks like. Look at all them lighting. I'm not going to do too much filming because I want you guys to see the video when it actually comes out. And it's actually an episode of, I think, 10 parts but just look at it how it is with all these lighting and this is how a professional studio setup is feeling a bit nervous let's see how it goes my brother's here he's gonna be participating so I don't know who's gonna do it because his knowledge is more better than mine I'm actually knowledge of I'm not sure like it is cool which are nervous to feel hot running So guys, it's all going to start literally in about 5-10 minutes. Feel a bit nervous. But um, let's how it goes. First time here. And um, let's just have some fun. And um, just be yourself, be natural. Just calm a little bit because <laughs> when I first came here, I feel a bit nervous. My heart was racing a little bit. Boom, boom, boom. But um, when it starts, let's see. Very nice studio. And it's absolutely big. I don't know actually the entire size of this, but I would say probably about 20 foot, 20 square foot. And I believe there is a few more of these studios. How many studios is there, Kibra, by in this building? It's one so far. We will have it. Um, we'll be having four studios um, very soon. So three studios will be built outside. I think um, it's on this side. Uh, this is a temporary studio, by the way. Okay. And another one is being built um, on the, the other side over there. On the other side. So, yeah, four studios. So the massive. This is a very small studio. We can't do all our production that, that we usually used to do but as uh, soon as our students will uh, they, they get ready so we'll be able to continue with our uh, production those big productions that we used to do mm -hmm. thank you for that but um guys it's actually really nice to be in this place because when i first drove here i thought i've come to an industrial unit uh, which is an industrial unit and then you come through this corridor so many small small offices and you've got such a nice setup with kitchen cafeteria and it is actually humongous it's huge and they have got a lot of state-of-the-art equipment and there's so much people working here behind the scenes because when you watch so many programs on tv you don't actually see all the people behind it but here we had a few people there was one person fixing my shirt and the speaker here as you can see there was another person making sure we're in the right angle and i've got a bit of problem just fidgeting all the time like moving around so I think I need to practice on that and not fidget because a lot of time I get nervous and I keep on touching or touching my hair or touching my face and pulling my shirt and when you do things like that in front of the camera it doesn't look very professional and uh, it's just a practice it's an art acting is not actually easy it's art and when you actually sit next to professionals like Kibria Bai it makes us look like amateurs welcome to guess what guys that's a wrap for today i don't think i've done really well i'm a little bit disappointed because i think i could have done a bit better but it's one of them things i mean that's why i see him and i say ah it doesn't it's easy i thought it's going to be very simple walk in the park you know but in the bengali and that's what it was today but anyway i think i've done well and uh, the nervousness is gone now and next time i come inshallah i think i will just rock the floor 
I'm only joking, guys. Thank you very much, uh, Kibria Bai. Thank you very much, Channel S, every single one of you. As I said, um, hats off to you all for building this amazing studio, giving all of us an opportunity, creating this platform for the Bangladeshi community. I wish you all the very success in the future. And um, congratulations to everyone. And guys, for, thank you very much for watching Ash Vlogs. Please like, comment and share and subscribe to Ash Vlogs. And thank you very much for your love and support. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Thank you.